to look at you. The Master Assassin. So you want to know about Delilah? Well, my uncle is bewitched by her, so he won't tell you anything. I require only two things. Get rid of my uncle, and bring me his last will and testament. In exchange, I'll tell you what you want to know about Delilah Copperspoon. And I'll pay you cold hard coin for your trouble. Come back to me when it's done. Let's meet at the docks when you return. Wow, so once again we have people demanding us more things, which I guess is great. Oh, there's the guy's head. I'm going to grab him. And now we can continue along here. Very nice, very nice indeed. Am I missing anything? No? Nope. Okay, so we have to kill her uncle, apparently, and bring her his last will and testament. So that'll be kind of interesting, I guess. Let's... Can... Please? I got to climb... Really? There we go. Okay. Oh, boy. All right, so now we get, actually have to get into the legal district. There is a tripwire right there. So we have to be very careful about that. Can I disable? Oh, I'm going to trigger it. Wow, I tossed a grenade right out. That's pretty crazy. Okay, cool. Wow, that was good by me to see that then. Okay, so now we're back in action here. We need to find his last swollen testament and the husband itself. Got ourselves a grenade from the loot launcher, so that's not too bad. There's some more traps here. Holy crap. All right. All right, we're going to drop that out. So there's a ton of traps. So I guess that's what they were talking about when they were talking about some security. So that's kind of interesting, I guess. Got a bunch of raving lunatics over here that I want to be careful about, obviously. Man, this is kind of a really crappy area in a good way. So I did miss a bone charm, possibly. So I'm going to pay attention for that. Okay, so it's in the room next to me. I will go back and see where that is because I don't obviously want to miss it. And is it right behind this wall? Okay, it's behind this wall. Okay, so now we have... Whoa, way too many people to start doing stuff here. So let's actually take out the... Le well, I was going to say take out the point guy here and that would be easy to do. But might as well take out a guy that's urinating because that was pretty easy. And since they're not actual guards, they don't have any means of, you know, sounding alarms besides yelling to each other about stuff of that nature. So anyways, let's take out this guy as well. Oh, that's cool. I got a kill cam. It's pretty much like Sniper Elite V2 if you've ever seen that game. Basically, if you every so often when you get a kill, it will go into slow-mo and show you what happens. So that's pretty cool. And now, I thought there was a third guy here, and I'm going to be... I'm gonna, at least I'm going to try to be very careful... Who knows what'll actually happen, but I think we might be okay to drop down here. Okay, so maybe the other guy just kind of disappeared and we don't have to deal with him too much. That shadow kill oh, is so helpful, though, because it really allows you to... Holy shit. That was really close. Let's choke you out here. I love how you can actually drag people while you choke them as well. I never actually remember that from the vanilla games, so... That's, that's cool if it's added, and if it wasn't added, then I'm kind of pissed that I never figured that out. Oh, well. We've got some house keys here and some coins. I'll take that. Ooh. To-do list. Loot that one place. Get even with Craxton. That key we've nicked from the watch can get us inside the legal district. Oh, it's good that we picked it up. We'll need some nice pawnables from the lawyer types later tonight. And there's a key apparently upstairs. So that'll be good. So that means we actually have to deal with some more enemies as well, though. So that might be... A little bit on the tougher side, and of course, we do not want to miss that bone charm. It's going to be somewhere around that side, so we just have to be careful. Oh, there's a guy walking here. Oh, shit. Yep, he found me out, man. All right, let's fight you to the death here. Of course, there are guys coming down. Gosh darn it. That is unfortunate. These guys are not that difficult to go here. Gosh darn it. I should have been paying more attention because I would have noticed that guy and I wouldn't have had to mess around with that one. Oh, come on, man. Come on. Uh, do I have an autosave? No, I honestly don't think so. That's that's real shitty. Oh, well. I should be more careful. Oh, well. All right, well, we'll kill them and be even more high chaos because that's kind of shitty. Huh. Should probably use more guns as well. No, I want to... Use a Sokolov elixir there. Okay, so 
we're back on track, I guess, in a way. But we still have to deal with these jerk-offs. And, of course, they're all over. And here's our key to the legal district, so that's good that we found that. That is good to go now, so we have a nice little way in. And ways in are always nice, so... Continue. Is that gas? Okay. I thought that might have been a trap or something, so... You gotta be very careful for some more tripwires, possibly, as well. Is there weepers up here? Oh, my. This is a very dank and dirty place. It could be... Probably get sick just from being here and inhaling all these fumes here. Chauncey? Who's Chauncey? I guess we might find out here. Oh, a teacup. That's cute. There's got to be something about this guy. They wouldn't just name him and leave him here to be dead, so... Interesting. Interesting indeed. Oh, man. This is a very expansive area with guards, so... We're going to have to be even more careful. That's great, I guess. Let's go upstairs. Okay, we can't go upstairs. So we're going to have to try to find a way to get that bone charm, among other things. Let's open this door. Let's see if there's anything in here. Nope, just a locker here. Who the hell is Chauncey, though? That's odd. Normally they'd leave a book or some sort of audio log or anything in here, but they left nothing, man. It's poor Chauncey. Okay, so let's hop down this way and check out how we can possibly get this bone charm in the house under us here. Wow, man, you just get through one part of the level and then things just open up considerably, and I do like that a lot. Did I just come out of this house here? I did. I didn't actually know there was this thing here, though, so... Can we blink to it? I don't... I don't think we can get to there from here. That's it's kind of unfortunate. We don't have blink to... That costs four runes, so we're going to have to be very prudent in our s search of this area, so... Jump down this way. I have no problems here. Is there anyone in here besides... An, oh, it's an outsider shrine, it looks like. That is helpful. Let's close this behind us and see if we can talk to the outsider here. Oh, no. This is a, a granny area. Granny's recipe here. Cruel Nancy, take the world from her greedy hands. Lay it before the black-eyed groom. Cut sharp, cut deep, red drip drop. Last and least, burn it to the hearth of a lawless man. Do this for me, dearie, and I'll give you a birthday treat. Okay, so cool. You get the granny recipe in two areas. So I guess that's like a running gag, I guess, here. Interesting. And we also got introduced to a new gang. I forgot to mention the Hatter Street Gang. Those are the guys that we killed right in the beginning of this area here. Let's check out what this bone charm has to give us here. Ooh, I will definitely do that. We will... The Hardy Crew. So now we can possibly use our Summit Assassins for some good here. So that's awesome, and we get some more mana. That's always great. We never really use much of it, because I'm always really slow and careful. But hey, you know, it is what it is. You choose how to play the game, so now we can actually probably use a sleep dart to our advantage now, because we know there, there's a wealth of them around. Man, this is kind of creepy. The outsider walks among us. That's pretty typical granny, though, so not really too surprised of the scrawlings on the wall here. Holy moly, look at these guys here. That is going to be something that we might have to deal with. Can we summon assassin? Another? Probably not. Okay. We're going to have to be super careful here. That is kind of unnerving in a way. But anyways. Oh, got some coins here. Can we blink? Oh, we can blink up here, right? No? It's kind of weird that the game does that. So, now we're kind of SOL on the ground here. I'm going to try to get up onto here because... It's got a very nice vantage point to it. I would really like if I could. Yeah, this will be pretty easy. I don't think that there is anyone around here. Uh, ooh, we do. We can get into the Hatter House here. Oh, this is just a way out from the other side because I think I killed that guy there. Could be wrong, but then again, I don't think so. Yeah, these are the. This is the the death and destruction that you get used to when you're around me, man. And toss that head over that way. We don't need you. You're just a head, man. All right. Let's see what we got going on over this way. There's our legal district, so that might be a way in. But there's so much more to discover here. I, I really do want to search around for a little bit. Let's check our void gaze really quickly. There's a bone charm in this house. There is the legal district there and the oil tanks. So it's not like it doesn't look like we're missing much. But then again, that could change as we go along here. 
depending on whether or not we actually can get into this house. Oh, shit, we still have to watch over that guard out there. Yep, that could have been insanely bad for us here. There are two guards up there, too, if you remember, and another guard here. Whoa, what's this? Mission clue. The Hatters may have the key. Oh, we, we grabbed the key, didn't we? Yeah, I mean, that was... We did that a while ago. Anyways, let's... There is a guy that was patrolling over that away way too. Holy moly, man. This place just is as tall as it is big. So that's really good, actually. Oopsies, I mean to do that. Let's let our blink come back. I want to jump really high and see if I can blink up onto this area here. Wait, I don't have agility? Did I never buy that upgrade with my rune? Oh, I do have two runes here. Okay, so I never bought agility but we don't need that right now I don't think let's hop up onto here there was another guard that was patrolling that away and let's see we're kind of out of this guy's range of sight which is good so now we can see what we can do about securing the bone charm in this house looks like there's a, gra a street level entry so that could be an interesting way to get in but there's also this perch up here and I want to see what the hell's up there so let's get as high as we can. Let's see, oh, we can't blink up this way. All right, great. Okay. There's got to be people in here, or maybe this is just a nice way to travel down here. Could be possible. Could be completely. Oh, here's a bone charm. Is this what? Is this the one that we missed, or not missed, but that we were looking at? Let's see here. No, I don't. I don't need adrenaline. I'm not an adrenaline assassin, so that's not too bad. Check. Go back on the void gates here. So that was the bone charm that we had to get. So that's good. Alrighty. What can we do about the guards all up in this area here? I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Because I don't think this guy... Hmm. Alright, let's choke this guy out. We'll carry you because we obviously don't want you making much of a sound here. We'll drop you here. Wait, someone heard that? Or maybe someone found out that someone was missing? Weird. Alright, so what am I gonna... I wanna blink this way. And we can probably blink right back out and choke out this guard now. So that's good. That is two of the sky guards down, which is nice. Oh, it looks like we got something here as well. Oh, maybe not. Oh, missing key. Looks like the hatch broke in and took the key. Okay, so... That was the key that we grabbed from before. Oh, shit, I completely forgot about... Or I didn't forget, I completely did not know there was more to this area, and that makes me a little bit nervous, because that means there's a huge possibility that there are more people here. So we're going to have to be very careful, we're going to be looking for shadows, among other things. But for now, it looks like we are a little bit clear here. I obviously don't want to speak before I'm proven wrong, but it looks like... We're doing okay for now. Collecting money as we go along. I really do want to get into the legal district ASAP, so we'll see about that. Look at some more entrails over here. What a what a nice appetizing sight. Looks like someone can be coming close to us though, so can I actually blink on top of this thing? I will do that if I have a chance, because now I can get the drop on someone if need be, because it sounds like at least from the text, that someone could be close. So, we will we'll see what we can do about getting down here. I don't see anybody. Oh, yep, there he is, there he is, there he is. Let's go back and do our strategy so we can get the jump on this fool. I will kill him if need be. Whew, that was close. See, I knew someone was going to be coming up those stairs. Probably because no guards checked in for their checkup. Not in the doctor's sense either, because they were too busy getting choked out. Come on and walk by, dude. Ah, uh, that's frustrating. You can't see a shadow, and you can't use void gaze, void gaze to watch them. You know, I might as well level that up with my runes. I don't know. I'm still kind of hesitant about that, though. I'm sure you guys would understand. I don't want to waste two runes just on one upgrade I might just use for this situation because the upgrades do carry over into the next DLC so be very very careful about that What's going on? see now really took him that long to get up around here 
that's kind of dumb, in my opinion. But anyways, Probably we did everything. avoid him. Did he just walk by? Yes, he did. Yes, he did. You've just watched an episode from my Let's Play of the Knife of Dunwall DLC for the game Dishonored. Let me know what you think in the comments below if you feel like discussing things. If you liked it, like it. And if you want more, subscribe. But either way, I will catch you in the next episode. See you guys later.